you guys welcome back to my channel i'm super excited to be filming my updated hijab collection plus like my updated styles it's been forever since i've done a hijab tutorial and i've kind of updated my style and have a few different tips and tricks for you guys and i always get asked which hijabs i'm wearing and i kind of just rotate between the same ones all the time so i thought i would just show you guys like my staples in my collection. First off, I want to thank BetterHelp for sponsoring today's video. I'm super excited to be partnering with them because I've mentioned to y'all actually recently that I have started using BetterHelp again and they have made such a dramatic impact on my life and I'm super excited to share them with you guys. Their mission is to make professional counseling accessible and affordable for everyone. All therapists on the platform are licensed, trained, and accredited. If there's something that's interfering with your happiness and preventing you from reaching your goals, then you should not have any hesitation in seeking help for yourself. I personally started using BetterHelp to help with my negative self-talk and anxiety and I have seen such a world of difference after even just a couple of weeks of meeting with my therapist. Once you sign up for BetterHelp you can start communicating with your therapist within 48 hours and it's not a crisis line or a self-help line it's professional therapy done securely online. BetterHelp has over 20,000 therapists in their network which gives you access to therapists that may not be available locally to you. Their services are available worldwide and you can log in and message your therapist at any time. You will get timely and thoughtful responses and you can schedule weekly phone or video sessions with your therapist that way you're not having to sit in any uncomfortable waiting rooms. It's so easy and free to change therapists if you need to. It's more affordable than traditional offline therapy and you can get financial aid if you need it. Visit betterhelp.com that's betterhelp.com and join over 2 million people who are taking charge of their mental health. They actually gave me a special offer for you guys to get 10% off your first month. I will leave that link down below in the description box and on screen. First I thought I would start out by showing you guys my like most worn and most loved chiffons. Two of my favorite brands that I like to purchase from are Zahra the Label and Veiled Collection. They have like my favorite colors and materials right now. I know that I guess someone who is not into nude hijabs might just look at these and be like they're all the same but listen they are not all the same. They have very different distinct purposes for different outfits and I like to rotate through all of these and Basically, if I had just these hijabs, then I would be set for every single outfit that you could ever wear. First, I'm going to start with Veiled Collection because I'm actually wearing one of their hijabs right now. This is their premium chiffon in the color Santorini. This is such a versatile pinky nude color that just matches so many different outfits and I wear this one constantly as you guys know. They also have a beautiful like a little bit more pink chiffon and this is the color Doha. I really prefer from Veiled Collection their premium chiffon. I know that they have their like more basic chiffon that I think is a little bit cheaper and they even go on sale sometimes to around like four dollars but I've just found that you really get what you pay for and the material is just so much more smooth on the premium and it just lays around the face so much prettier so that is my um, recommendation so this one was Veiled Collection the rest on here are from Zahra the label and they also have a premium chiffon line as well that's a little bit smoother like I said but they also have their basic basic luxe chiffon which several of these are basic luxe and it still flows really beautifully. It does have a little bit more like texture and grip to the fabric which honestly helps with like not slipping around your face but I still feel like their um, basic luxe chiffon just really still flows really well around my face too. So I'm going to show you guys my favorite colors from them. First up is this beautiful ivory color. I don't really like wearing white hijabs just because, I don't know, I just feel like it doesn't really flatter my skin tone that much. Maybe if I had more of a cool skin tone it would look great, but I feel like if you have a warm skin tone then just going with a little bit more of an ivory looks a lot more flattering around your face. So this one I wear so much. If you ever had an outfit that you really needed to pair white with it, I always go for the ivory just because it's a lot softer and just looks more flattering. Next up is Modest Nude. This one is a little bit more taupey and this one is in their premium chiffon material so it's a little bit more smooth and just flows a little bit better. It will literally match everything. It's just a little bit more, I wouldn't say, yeah it's a little bit more cool tone and just has, has a little bit more touch of taupe in there. So I do actually find myself wearing this one more. The color is just a little bit pinkier and this is the color Nabila. This is in their basic luxe chiffon so just a little bit less 
smooth, I would say. I find myself reaching for Nebula actually a little bit more because it's a little bit more of a warm tone and I feel like just more pinky warm nudes just look best on me. It's very similar to the one that I'm wearing from Veiled Collection, but this is just the um, option from Zahra the Label that's very, very similar. Lastly, this is a um, chiffon from Zahra the Label, but it's not available on her website right now. I think this one was called Chestnut, but since this is one that I reach for constantly, especially during like the fall winter time, I always like to like pair like warm browns with my outfits. I am gonna link a very similar one from Veiled's collection that I saw. I think it's called Tulum, but this is just a really beautiful like chestnutty color brown that just really flatters warm skin tones beautifully. Next up, I want to chat about the underscarves that I wear with the chiffon hijab. Zahra the label has a version that ties in the back. It is a little bit bigger, I would say, so if you have a lot of hair, then definitely go for the Zahra the label one because it will fit all your hair in there but it has this mesh material at the back so it's a breathable and I like the ones with the ties just because you can really tie it securely that way it's not going to slip back as much so I really like the Zahra the Label one and then they also have a similar one from Veiled's collection with that mesh but I feel like it's a little bit smaller so for me I like this one because it feels a little bit more secure since I don't have enough hair to fill this one both of these are great options just since they do have the tie in the back that way they they are really secure and don't slip. Next, I wanted to chat about how I create this like style. I have struggled for so many years loving this style on other people, but I could never like get it to sit right around my face. And whenever I would like pin it, I would just have like weird points at the top of my head, which I just don't really prefer on me. So basically I found the perfect hack to get this look without it budging and without creating like, I don't know, without it really moving throughout the day. So I take these little fashion tapes strips that I can link down below for you guys. I get these on Amazon. So I go ahead and I take a piece of the fashion tape and since I've been sharing this a lot of people have been asking me if the tape leaves a residue on your hijabs or on your underscarf or anything and I honestly have not had it leave any kind of residue or have any negative effects with my hijabs at all. I think since it's meant for clothing I think that's why it just does so well and doesn't leave any stickiness or anything like that. So I go ahead and I add the tape about an inch away from the edge of my hijab cap and then I just take my hijab, I line it up with the edge of the hijab cap as well and then I just press it down and that is literally it. I just throw it over my shoulder and I find that it stays in place all day now you could add a couple more pieces of tape just so it's really secure and you could also pin it on your shoulder so that it doesn't move there as well but i have worn this style to the beach and with lots of wind and it stays put something else that i wanted to mention in this video even though i don't reach for them as much but now that i'm thinking about it it probably would keep this style even more secure so these are hijab magnets these i got from um, veils collection but you can get them different different places i like these because they're neutral and what you can do is you can take your hijab under your chin use the magnet to keep it in place that way you're not snagging your hijab too with a pin. Just to let you guys have another option to keep the style a little bit more secure. Then I thought while I was doing this video I would go ahead and add in my like classic OG hijab style that I've worn for years because I have done several videos on this but I just thought in case anyone is new. So I go ahead and take one short side and one long side. I feel like I'm so old school whenever I'm doing this video because this is just like the old school hijab tutorials. Um, then I like frame it around my face and I tuck these two pieces underneath my chin like that and have them folded. Then your long side, you will keep the edge folded as you bring it around. Fun fact, this is the second time I'm doing this because the first time I did it, I had these terrible pit stains. So I had to go dry my dress with a hair dryer. <laughs> I use a pen for this style just because that's what I'm so used to, but I think you could probably use a magnet, even though I probably wouldn't because I feel like you'd see the magnet right there. But I put the pen right by the edge where my jaw is. And then I tuck the short side in. And then I bring the long side around and 
flip it over my shoulder. That is my classic style. Now, if you guys follow any of my other vlogs or like stories or anything, you guys know when I'm not wearing a chiffon hijab and I need to be wearing a hijab and just run out to run errands or run to pick up Elena or something, I'm always wearing this hijab. This is the Instant Jersey by Voile Chic. And I stocked up on this, you guys. I bought like probably 10 of them and I just keep wearing them. It matches everything. This color is just a very just universal color that will match every single outfit. I love the material. It's very thin, so it's perfect for basically all year round. And it's so easy because all you do is you slip your head through and then you just wrap it around once. No pins, no nothing. It is amazing. And I've tried several brand instant jerseys and this one is still just my favorite because it's so thin and just let me show you guys what it looks like on. Here's what it looks like when you place your head through the hole. It's literally the most simple thing. I just take the long side and I keep it folded as I bring it around my head. And then you just flip it over your shoulder like that. And that is literally it. This is seriously the easiest thing ever when you need to just throw on a hijab and head out the door. This is like my go-to mom hijab. <laughs> I hope that this video was helpful to you guys. I'm gonna have everything that I mentioned linked down below in the description box. And I would love it if you guys liked this video. Please give it a thumbs up so it helps me out with the algorithm and subscribe if you're new. And thanks again to BetterHelp for sponsoring today's video. I will have a link to join BetterHelp down below as well. And I love you guys and I'll see y'all in my next one. Bye.